This is Mario with MIA Microflight, and this is another MIA Trica Sail Radio Control Land Yacht or Land Sailors. Today is a very, very cold day here in Arizona. You can see the winds are there, but it's not consistent. But it gives me a good enough. Uh, there we go. There we go. It's picking up. It gives me a good idea of what I can expect if I were to run this by the ocean side or in an open parking lot. The frame is uh, steel square tubing that was taken out from a broken patio umbrella. So I kept those parts and I made the 3D printed couplers that you see here, the uh, steering block, the base to mast post or block, and the coupler here or the T that couples the base to the rear axle. The wheels are 3D printed. The tires are made from uh, PVC uh, uh, tubes. Um, they're almost sort of pneumatic because they're hollow inside the, the, the tubing here. The servos are um, Hextronix HX12K. They're um, standard size servos, pretty beef, beefy servos. My sail control is just this arm here. It opens up fully that much, and when it's closed, it's about that much. When it's fully open, it opens up a little bit wider. My steering. All the wheels run on ball bearings. Uh, my radio is tied to just a little single cell battery there, just for simplicity. And I have a couple weights at the back. These clamps here acting as weights because it was a little windy today, just to keep it on the ground. Anytime you see the model accelerating, it's because I am giving it throttle and I'm tightening the sail like, like right there. So it really accelerates when there's consistent wind here. Because as the sail tightens, it tends to push on the model like that. Open up the sail on turns, tighten it on uh, long runs. The winds are a little bit erratic, so I cannot get a consistent run here in my backyard. There we go, there we go. And this is the new land yacht I just put together using uh, some new 3D printed wheels. These run on ball bearings, so it's very smooth. And this will pick up uh, quite a bit of speed with consistent winds.